I can see it through the camera. Feeling all right, mate? Can. Shakes, fever, chills. Good. I'll introduce myself later. Right now, we gotta get you the hell out of there. Do exactly as I say, okay? You're gonna have to trust me. It says the you need to disembodied voice the in the camera. Search in the maintenance storage room by the end of the corridor. I would move if I were you. Now. It's like a live stream of Sliver. Crouch. Ninja. <laughs> Can't hurt to look. Well, I don't got a weapon, but I do have five bucks. Lincoln will save me. I'll just bribe the zombies. They'll see reason. You'll see. As long as I've got cold, hard simoleons. They'll see things my way. <laughs> Where's that funky magazine again? Lemon juice. Any zombie gets fresh with me and I'll just squirt some lemon juice in their eyes. They'll be way too busy writhing in agony, grabbing their empty eyeball sockets to try and rape me. Money. More glue. Alcohol. And another phone. Alright, where are we going? Oh. Those bodies did not look like they were there like five seconds ago. We have achieved teleporting zombies. Apparently the teleporting process has not been perfected and they die upon uh, rematerializing. Too bad for them. Zombie teleportation had so much promise. Run, run for the storage room! Run for the storage room! I don't know what that is! Holy crap! Just a big father! Oh no, no! There was there was a bag there! I I wanted the bag. Oh Zombies don't know how to put their Oh my goodness. TKO Mario counted my ass out. She gave me a straight soda popinski hook to the jaw. That's killer. So a zombie infection turns everybody into a boxer. I'm doing it. She's, no! Oh, he's doing it. Oh, he's going to beat me to no, death with a bat. Hey. Can you hear me? Well, everybody, this was a I'm short saying. game. Not your head. 17 Not your whole minutes head. of gameplay. I ain't asking you again. Oh, thank God. Calm down, Crocodile Dundee. I'm a doctor, not a bloody expert. Thought you used a knife anyway. You know Guess you got to improvise in a zombie apocalypse. That chick is gone. Hello. Person that was about to kill me. Screw it. You suck. <sighs> Fuck, I should have never listened to Cinemoy. Yeah. I should have left with the others. Yeah. Me too? Fuck, I should have stuck with James. Yeah, James. That guy was going places. Yeah, everybody was leaving. That dude is a badass, whoever he is. That's right. Your face hole is not convincing me, expression wise. But for the sake of progress, we will uh, we will do it. Why not? Yes, I am nuts. I woke up with a wicked hangover and a zombie apocalypse happened. Uh, I'm pretty sure I'm okay now. Don't let him die. Fine then. 
F. F is the new E. You'll see. It'll catch on. On three. One, two, fuck it, three! Fuck it, three. Oh, yeah. Holy crap. You are getting overwhelmed, dude. Hello. Not another hook. Seriously, that's getting annoying. Whoa. Hello. 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 He's got money on him. Ooh, he's got wire. They're coming again. What? They've called for backup. Hey. That's the last I one. Like your style. Okay then. Thanks, mates. That voice sounds a little off when I look at you. Okay, no, I'll go with it. Person with the Mike Tyson Where tattoo. Noir! Can you hear me? Shit. Noir? We were just attacked. Listen, your friend from the hotel's awake. You were right about him being immune to this thing. If it wasn't for him, we wouldn't have made it. Maybe now we can hold out until help arrives. There is no help. This thing can't be stopped. I saw how it took my wife. You need to get out of there, and I can help you. I can arrange for transportation. By air, by sea, but first you need to get here. To me. I have many sick and injured here, mate. They're crazy with fear. Tell me where you are. Where are you? You there, mate? Hello? Hello? Does this guy not God know that it. there are raptors out there somewhere? Stalking us make in the jungle? Getting better. No thanks to you. Pretty sure there's a T-Rex too. Name's John Cinemoy. I'm the head lifeguard here. The voice on the radio told me you were in trouble at the hotel. Said you were resistant to whatever this is. I didn't believe it. And Yay I found for I saw me. The bite marks. You got no symptoms, but <laughs> those aren't love bites, are they? I don't know who you are or how you know that guy on the radio, but he's our only connection with the outside world. We keep losing the bloody signal. We have a monsoon coming. So here's the thing: we need to move everybody to the main lifeguard station. There's an ambulance there and more equipment and a stronger radio with an antenna. You don't say. I hate to ask, but we can't do this without you. Will you help me? Do I have a choice? Sure. Yes. Good. First off, we need an access card to get Way past home. the security gate. Mine's in my room. With all the commotion, I forgot to take it with. It's in Bungalow 11, by the pools. Take Bungalow a weapon and watch way. yourself. You may be immune, but I don't mean you can't die. Aptly put. I just wish that every single character in this game didn't look like they had a stroke and just are completely incapable of any type of facial expression. That's, that's pretty much the only thing I have against this game right now. It's been pretty entertaining thus far, though. It's got kind of this B-movie-ish quality to the dialogue and kind of how the voices match the NPCs they're attached to. You know, almost in the sense kind of like the old uh, Kung Fu movies with the Wu-Tang, how the voices never match the character. I think the facial expression does have something to do with that, though. But, you know, it it's a game about a zombie apocalypse, so... Or a infected zombie apocalypse, whatever you want to call it, but... This is the end I think it's still Judgment credible. And it can be entertaining if you choose to believe it. I don't really need the energy drinks, so... It's in the Book of Revelations. It's in the Book of Revelations. So much Look stuff is in the Book of Revelations. Yes, yes, Mr. 
I don't even know what you are. Ooh, I got two paddles. One second. Sound resumed. Aha. All right. Sorry about that. Yes. Now they do not hear me. Okay, now it's uh Nar Shada is fucking time to gorgeous. roam. Oh. A metal paddle that looks like wood. Metal that looks like wood. We have come so far. A battered broomstick. Excellent. Raw. That will do nicely. Let's go out here and enjoy the water. And maybe a chest. Maybe there's something useful. Absolutely. Brass knuckles. I have skill points. I can have skill points. Unleash your fury to use your most lethal skills to quickly deal with nearby enemies. Hmm. Blade fighter. Sharp weapons are now more efficient and effective. So I do more damage, it takes less stamina, I get a better critical hit chance, and precise hit on the head inflicts more damage. That sounds very useful. And survival is straightforward, med kits are 25% more effective. Hmm. All of those sound pretty good. Blood Rage. That sounds pretty nice. Kind of reminds me of the uh, brick from Borderlands, the Berserker. Or as I like to call him, the Odor Blocker from Old Spice. Goes into that crazy raid and just starts punching things to death while uh, somehow stealing energy in their, from their souls to heal himself. Hmm. Blade Fighter sounds like it would be really good. Mm, yeah, sure, why not? Blade Fighter, I choose you! When using a sharp weapon, you can trigger the special attack if you press the left mouse button while aiming for the enemy's head. Excellent. Good stuff.